You want to discuss the TIV2 work list yeah. that we got Let's lined up? Well, as you can see, the power steering pumps on top and the auxiliary compressor pumps down there on the bottom on the driver's side. Those are the two two pulleys we need to deal with on trying to get the FIAD noise to go away. Okay. Um, the exhaust leak over on this side, I'm not sure if it's the manifold yet or the turbo gasket or downpipe. Probably clean up a little bit of the wiring that he's got here under the hood. Okay. Are we going to reuse the k and air filter or are you wanting to try and rig up a factory air box again? That's something we probably give Sean a call. We prefer the factory air box, so we'll have to verify with the owner first. Okay. So. But uh, either way, we need to make sure we get this thing turned around quick because he needs to be ready for the 2012 tornado season, which is quickly coming upon us. Doing? doing all right, how are you? Oh, good, thank you. I heard you did a lot of stuff. Yes, we have. We've <laughs> found done. a lot of surprises. We have found a lot of surprises, cleaned a lot of things up. Uh -huh. We uh, got your hose fixed that was oh, dangling here, so thank your you. spike works now. So we added the, added the wrap around here to help protect oh, yeah. from where it comes out so it doesn't chafe anymore. Uh -huh. Added the Cummins logo. Uh -huh. Uh, it looks like the nicest part of the truck. Now. <laughs> I don't know you, about you that. You know, I'm going to have to uh, now repaint the vehicle so it looks as nice as the logo. <laughs> we uh, completely went through and rebuilt your front axle, uh -huh. put new uh, U joints, oh, wow. hub bearings, rotors, calipers, oh, wow. pads. Um, went through, bled all the brake system out so everything works good. It drives and brakes fine now. Your pads were actually about wore out. So. Oh, okay. um, Went through, as you can see here, we went through and cleaned up a oh. bunch of your wiring. Oh, wow. I found several wires that just kind of went to nothing. Oh, wow. uh, we removed all the all the aftermarket stuff that was on here. Okay. Put the engine back to all stock. We added the fan shroud back on here to uh -huh. help with cooling of the engine. I put a new intake on because the other one had the holes for the aftermarket in it. I was able to get you a factory air box reinstalled and help oh, the engine awesome. breathe better. Uh, installed a new turbo on it to help with your uh, exhaust leak and your boost issue you were having. We realigned your Fiat assembly as you heard. It's uh, no longer squealing anymore. Oh, awesome. It looks incredible now. It really looks... It's a huge relief to see it in this shape. It looks outstanding. It really looks outstanding. If you want to look here on the front side, uh, shut the hood here oh, so we can see it a little bit better. Oh, you guys blinkers on. Your headlights were on the one toggle switch. Uh -huh. Your headlights are now on the actual headlight switch on the dash. Oh, they are. So oh. when you turn the headlight switch on, on okay. your headlights come okay. on and your brake lights, your tail lights come okay. on. Okay. Okay. So everything should, as far as lighting go, function on the uh -huh. factory switches correctly okay. now. Okay. Wow. I don't know if you want to hop on in here, I can kind of walk you through what I did inside. Again, I just kind of cleaned up a little bit of the wiring stuff. You had the, the performance box here. I got rid of it totally, and then you had the the house light switch to control your air compressors. Okay, yeah. I totally did away with that, and I actually have a toggle switch okay. here now that I've labeled. Okay. And it comes on. Um, there's a fuse panel. I put a fuse block back by your oh, air you compressors okay. that has a main feed going into it, and uh -huh. then it's got six fuse you know, fuse places that you okay. can hook additional things oh, into. Awesome. So there's two um, 15 amp fuses in there currently right now with okay. two of your air compressors hooked up. What are you doing for the next uh, six weeks? <laughs> I'll be working here. Oh, okay. Okay. Just checking. Just checking. We are all ready then. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Acceleration is really nice on it. It's night and day uh, as far as how it sounds and how it's, it's the power is, is it's, it's getting up to speed quicker. Um, 
I mean, just all the things under that hood. I mean, it looks fantastic, and it, it drives fantastic. If you had asked me how long the TIV was going to be around um, two months ago, I'd probably say that this was its last season, but now it's got new legs. So I think this vehicle is going to be around for a while now. I'm really happy that, um, you know, I'm working um, in conjunction with Cummins, that they're, they're, that they're helping um, with our mission. Uh, it's, it's fantastic. We have a vehicle that works better now, and they're great people to work with. So I look forward to, of course, this season of storm chasing and, you know, how things unfold in the future. There's no crying in the tent, so we should get out now. <laughs>